One out, bases loaded for the Phils. 1-1 one, one pitch. And that is line drive to center field, and that's going to get by Michael Taylor. He shouldn't have dove for it. It's going to roll all the way back to the wall. It's going to clear the bases and watch Altair run. Eikhoff's going to score easily. Here comes Altair. He's being waved around. No throw to the plate. How about that? It clears the bases. So here's Albers to face Aaron Altair. And Altair sends one in the air to deep left center field. Taylor going back. It is gone! And we are tied up at five! Off the bench, Aaron Altair! Three run home run. It's a 5 5 game. Wow, that's, that's a pretty thing right there. I think he hit a slider. One and two. And a hot shot through the hole on the left side. Nets going to score. And the Phillies have swept out the Pittsburgh Pirates with a run of the bottom of the 11th inning. They win it 3-2. to two. And look at the mob, Aaron Altair. A line drive toward left field. Ozuna's coming on. He dives. He can't get it. He kicks toward the warning track. One run is in. Santana's going to score. The Phillies will win. Six five in the bottom of the tenth inning on a poor decision by Marcelo Zuna. He left the gate open and the Phillies kicked it in. Uh, that ball ripped into right center field. Altair comes diving in and makes the catch. That's a run saving play by Aaron Altair. And that will wrap up the top of the fourth inning. Woo! That would have scored Jason Worth easily, and even with Weeder's speed, Weeders would have been at least at second base. Dodgers let him pitch. Swing and a miss. Altair, a 90-mile-an-hour high fastball, and the Phillies want the baseball. Look, they want the slider. Bullpen wants the slider. Swing and a miss. He got it with a 90-mile-an-hour fastball. A little cheese from Aaron Altair as he picks up his second strikeout here in the ninth inning. Did get it up. Now to shallow center. Galvis is looking for help. Here comes Altair. And he made the catch. He juggled it. And now they're going to get Bruce if the throw is clean. He's out. Oh, what a play all the way around with some total concentration. A double play. There are two outs here in the bottom of the seventh inning. It looked like it was going to be disastrous for a second. For Benintendi. Hanley hits it the opposite way on the run is Altair and reaches down and makes the catch. His throw to first to try to get Benatende. He got him at first base. Well, that's as athletic a play as you will find for an outfielder. We've been watching Mookie Betts these last couple of days and he's been fantastic. 2-2, swing at a high pop-up down the right field line towards the corner. Altair going over up along the sidewall. He leaps in the air, and oh, what he caught it. Wow, he caught it. He goes <laughs> up the sidewall with a long leap and that long arm, and somehow he pulls it down before it hits the padding. And the bases are loaded for Aaron Altair. One and one the count. Here's the pitch. Swung on, hit high, oh. hit deep, way back to left, and that ball is gone! Grand slam into the scoreboard porch in left. Aaron Altair has turned the game around. His 17th home run of the season, and how about that for breaking it over? A slam off Kershaw, it's 4-2 Phillies. Bryce Harper hits one well to left field, Altair going back toward the wall, jumps and makes the catch. And Bryce Harper on one pitch is retired. Now Bryce hit this ball pretty good, but I don't think he clipped it real well. But you see Aaron does a nice job getting back, seeing how much room he had. With runners on second and third. And a line drive out to right field. Altair comes diving in and makes the catch. And the inning is over. Ooh, he didn't baby. see it right away, but then burst toward it. And the Rays leap two in scoring position. No runs, one hit, and two men left. Oh, to be athletic. 
There you go. In the air to left field. Going there you back go. on his deep trick. It is gone! Second grand slam of the night for the Phils. Aaron Altair has given the Phillies a 9-1 lead. Hey, did, you ever, did you ever have an at-bat where you saw an old cheese on? I'm hanging on a thread here right now. I'm in a bad spell. The bases are loaded. And the left hander on the mound. I'm 0-2 on oh, Keith. Yeah. Next thing you know, you're running around the bases with a grand slam. 2-0 pitch. Popped him up oh, out way. toward left field. Altair. This will be interesting. Yeah, tagging at third is Lamb. Altair is behind it. Lamb's coming home. The throw to the plate is in time. A one hopper. And the inning is over. And that is a huge boost, not only for Jared Eikhoff, but for a Phillies team that's been struggling to score some runs here today. And a line in the right field, that'll drop in for a base hit. Rounding third, heading for home is Espinosa. The throw to the plate by Altair. He is out! Cameron Rupp took a shoulder from Espinosa and was able to hang on. I'll tell you, they don't come much tougher than Cameron Rupp. And if you don't think so, just look at the three collisions at home plate this year that he's been involved in.